with the shroom. Let me just turn that TV down a little. And we have my microphone here. And we'll move that into about that. There we go. And hopefully I don't run out of Joy-Con charge. <laughs> But I decided I want to play through No Sight Roads again on stream this time. I had recorded a full playthrough of this already for YouTube, and I, I originally was going to do a bit of post commentary let's play uh, with a co commentator, but I couldn't really find anyone to do it with. And then I just kind of felt like not wanting to edit it, and. Uh, yeah, here's the overlay. I'll turn that down a bit more. Um, didn't feel like editing the footage, and then rendering it would have taken a bit, and then I would have had to re-render it for again after doing commentary. So I figured, hey, I like this game. It's a very good game. Why don't I just stream through it again? Because <laughs> I happened to stream on this before, but I haven't like played the game, like, start to finish, I just kind of dived in and played some of the boss fights, but that was about that. All of the rendering, yes, yeah, so I'd have to render every part, like the raw episodes, then commentate with someone, then put the audio on the rendered video, and then render the render <laughs> just to have the YouTube version, and that wasn't... that would have taken a while. I wanted to do a bit of a different angle with it, I wanted to do this whole, let's compare the Switch version with the other versions, because it's kind of interesting um, that the version that I'm playing here, the Switch version is a little bit out of date in terms of um, its build, which I'm hoping that they do patch up, but it's kind of interesting to look at and document, but I feel like people have already done that um, on YouTube, so I was like, oh well. I could probably just stream it and be like, hey, did you know that this thing isn't the same over here? <laughs> uh, let's just do one player and let us begin. Hopefully audio is fine now. Question mark, maybe. If it's, if it's loud or if it's quiet or anything like that, just yell at me. But I'm just going to have a fun time playing one of this, this cool game. The biggest change can come from the most unexpected individual with the audience at your fingertips. All you need is a little push. Also, shout out to my friend Nova or Nefarious Codex on Twitter for the, um, the little image in the bottom right and that lovely bit of art of Susie. She drew that and it's awesome. This is my moment. This is what it's all about. Relax, matey. Uh, you you got got this. Oh, is, is the audio okay. not good enough? <laughs> is this my recording? I guess so. Hey, Zook! Uh, give me a minute. <sighs> shake it off, shake it off. I think it did take me about Your five hair hours total to finish the game Come on, on my recorded this is our television save. Debut. Yeah, uh, yeah, uh, yeah, I'm here. Are you guys ready? Wait, 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 wait. Okay, Zook, stand here, right here. Good. And I'll be at this the corner. Tattler, Just not like how bad. we practiced. Okay, I'll gotcha. Turn it down right, slightly. Awesome. I'm going to start the recording. I'd kind of like the audio to be <laughs> hearable, but not too quiet as well. <laughs> Please state your name and introduce yourself briefly. Hey, ya. the name's Mayday. I wield a guitar, there you and go. Nice. he is <laughs> Zook. And he plays the drums. And together we're Bunk Bed Junction. Woo! Hey Zook, there sure has been quite a lot of electronic music in the city lately. That's true, mate. But you know, this city still lacks a certain something, don't you think? Absolutely, mate. Luckily for you guys, we have the perfect fix. Why don't you tell him, Zook? Why me? We're Bunk Bed Junction, and we're going to... We're going to Junka, um, in their Bunka? No, wait, it's, uh... That's right, Zook! 
We're gonna bunk up, we're gonna junk up, and we're gonna bam in your faces! We're bringing back rock! This long-forgotten art used to be the backbone of Vinyl City, you know? So be ready to listen to our super tasty riffs of... Okay, cut. That's a good take. Oh, that's it? Yes, we got what we needed. Now oh. please make your way to the audition stage. Just follow the arrows. Thank you. No, thank you so much. I definitely think the Switch see. version does Next. hold up. I, I, it definitely has... I don't know if it is just this build, or if, like... The Switch version could look better, but it does have a bit of graphical quirk, but it still looks How pretty good, even on Switch. Um, I did notice a lot of differences when I was looking at like the PS4 version, which is the latest version. Oh, what the heck? <laughs> Don't screw this one up, okay? We have to look good in front of the world. Just kind of speedrun strats there, just to zip forward. <laughs> Are you ready? Why, hello, you two. Wow. Hello, Tatiana. Right, and you are. We're Bunk Bed Junction! Bunk Bed Junction? Yes, because you see, NSR needs more fans. So we're gonna build a new junction right into your highway so that more people can join this awesome full party! Bunk Bed Junction! Woo! Clever. I hope you put as much thought into your music cool. as you did with your band name. Hopefully, I so what will you play delayed for us today? the audio fine oh, as well. It's something the city needs! We're playing rock! Say again? Rock! We're here to bring it back to the top! Just like how cool Fyra did a long time ago! <clears throat> really? Very well then. Show me what you've got. It's time to... Start me! <laughs> that works. Alright, it's tutorial time! <laughs> Welcome to the Ennis oh, In this world, everything follows the music. Sort of, but actually not as much as you'd think. You don't. Uh, when I bought this game, I kind of assumed you'd have to, like, fully do your attacks in time with the music and stuff like that, but it's, it's a little more lenient and fair, I guess. But it would be cool if they made, like, a sequel where combat was more music focused. I definitely see them being able to flesh out this kind of game style a lot more if they were to make some sort of sequel or DLC or I don't know, I don't know what the creators' plans are. So it's like it's like fine opportunity between the beats, but you can just, you know, <laughs> you can just kill him like that. <laughs> you can skip the tutorial. It would be kind of nice if there was an option. Maybe there is an option and I just don't have it. <laughs> just thinking about it, maybe there is an option to skip the tutorial in like the PS4 version and PC version. I would not be surprised. Good. And what about you, other guy? Do you just flaunt your hair all day? I play the drums. Mm hmm Initiate the second phase. Alright, oh, it's so time to play as Zook. <laughs> it actually started to... When I first got this game, I thought I'd play as Mayday more, but I actually kind of grew to like Zook a lot during playing it, and I tend to play as him a bit more. 
Hello, heavy. Monkey sex. <laughs> So Zook is more of a combo master kind of character. There we go. Wow, I got hit in the tutorial. <laughs> okay, so here's just a the bigger aspect, you can do a bit of parrying with purple projectiles, which are totally optional, but they are pretty good to learn, and actually are pretty handy in later difficulties, I'll try and get it here. How are you? I am doing good. For the most part, at least. <laughs> Alright. The timing is actually very forgiving on the parries, which I like. It's not strict, and you don't get punished too much if you miss. You definitely have a very good opportunity to hit the parry, which is pretty nice. Oh, actually, here's one of my favorite things. If you do the drum thing or the guitar thing, it actually is in time now with the music. Let's see both of you used the skills to power up the quasar. There's no music playing the final here, phase. But... So if I do this and I go... You can't really hear it. There we go. And then Zook has a drum version. And pretty much all the boss tunes have, like... Little things like that. Lots of dynamic music, which I really like. <laughs> Take out these guys first. It feels wrong not having all my upgrades. <laughs> I kinda wish this game had a new game plus mode, if I'm honest. <laughs> Tutorial complete. <laughs> yes! We did it! We finished the course! Thank you! Thank you! Oh, there's so much electric in this room! How do you think it went? Brilliantly! Thought you'd say that. Fellas, what do you think? Well, one out of six ain't too bad. Hey, now wait a minute there. Can you just listen to... Zook, say something! I don't um, like it. <laughs> okay. This is... Hold on, hold on. I'll be blunt. You came here for us to judge you. And it looks like my artists have spoken. You have no future in show business. What? But, 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 but we, we managed to finish the arena and we... We reserve the right to reject you, even if you finish the course. We have the final say in everything. That's not fair! Please, we run on talent, not fairness. This audition is held to find the next best musician who meets our standards of excellence. And you certainly didn't qualify. Well, that's rich coming from a bunch of wannabe artists. See that X? It means you're done. If I were you, I would swallow my pride and use this time to rethink my career. You can't do this to me! I just did. No! I'm an artist! 
I'm a performer! A performer! I belong on this stage! Okay, I've heard enough. Thank you very much. Off you go. You haven't heard the last of me, okay? What do you know about rock? I bet you never even held a guitar in your life! Okay, listen, honey. You think you can just walk in here and drag us all into your silly fantasy? You are so naive to think that rock is still relevant. Stop living in the past. There is only one music in demand right now, and that is EDM. We're still listening. The age of rock about you, is <laughs> over. EDM rules this city. I like the whole rock versus EDM agenda in this game, but then you come to realize, hey, wait, all the music just sounds good anyway. <laughs> they can't do this to us. It's not cool. Super not cool. Can't believe they called us naive. Right? That was bulldozer. Bulldozer, you hear me? I feel you, man. I do. Listen. I know this didn't go as you planned. You think? But it's not good getting worked up over an empty stomach. Why don't we head back first? And grab some burgers. On me. Burgers. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> yeah, the sound <laughs> great. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this area is a little bit more vibrant in other versions. There's definitely a lot more lights and stuff. So th this will be an interesting play for so I'll get to like say, hey, this is this and this is different and check this out kind of thing. <laughs> Now, is this store the EDM art, or is it the ED Mart, or is it EDM Mart? I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Bumpin Junction, going all in for the final course. Hey, look, we're on TV. Isn't that great? <laughs> I, I, I like that you can just to back jump around shortcuts. during their talking series. SR, <laughs> they probably have unimaginably high standards when it comes to picking their candidates. It's like, hello, goodbye. <laughs> Wait, did you see that? We powered the Kwasa to almost full capacity. Did we? No. Mm, that is odd. <laughs> Those lying idiots. How could they scrap us when we outperformed all the other contestants? This is totally rigged. We need to take action. But there's no oh, I've lost myself. Hello, there's <laughs> always something we can do, Zook. <laughs> Believe me. If you say so, May. I'm Python. Ah, <sighs> Vinyl City. I'll never grow tired of seeing this. You know, maybe we're being too hard on NSR. This would make a very just nice desktop wallpaper. Ever since they took over. Oh no, Zook. You did not just say that. Come on. I know it sucks that they didn't pick us, but I like to believe that they did it based on fair, unbiased judgment. People of Vinyl City, this is Tatiana. In light of the recent abysmal performance of a certain door that we all had the unfortunate pleasure of having to sit through, I would like to announce that rock music is hereby banned from future lights up editions. Well, shit. For a better prospect of winning, we suggest that you stick to what works. EDM. Remember, we strive through order. Order leads to progress in Vinyl City. That is all. Have a pleasant evening. What? What the slimy possum did she say? Oh dear. Zook, this discrimination is so obvious. NSR can't do something like this. 
Who do these people think they are? Wait, it's freaking unfair. There must be a rational explanation for this. And it's so, May. so dopey. May. We gotta fix this right now. We need to. Hey, stop overreacting. Look around you. NSR may be jerks, but you can't deny that they're doing a great job at governing this city. If I could see your face, I'd punch it. What? No way! You see that? I don't believe it. Our city's backup energy is only supplied to the elites of NSR? That's messed up. First, they rejected us. Then, they denied our rights to rock out. And now they think they can keep the energy from the general public? This is wrong. This is an absolute abuse of power. I hate to say this, but I think you might be I remember watching when Miss Multi was streaming the PC sense. version of this. So tell me, and every time there was a cutscene like this, everyone's hair was just flipping out. Meanwhile, here it's just normal. <laughs> oh, we're gonna bunk up, we're gonna junk up, and we're gonna bam in their faces. Yes! Now you're talking. Roll credits. Oops. Thanks for watching, that was no straight <laughs>
What I'm saying is that you Plutonians are no longer relevant. Burn. Say what? So you think your music is so relevant, like, is it? Don't you know who I am? I am DJ Subatomic Supernova! My music will reach the furthest corners I of the I do like the, like, the screens what in the back that pretty much simulate what's this? going on in the scene here. <laughs> Actually, fun fact, somewhere in this map is just a random- wait, is it- is over there, I think? If I- If I just pause, there's a little bit on the left, at the very back, where there's like a black spot, where like the two lines in the background are. That black dot is apparently a random person from when you walk in. Um, there's all those guys. There's apparently just a guy chilling over there for no reason. <laughs> and I think they forgot to take him out. Because I remember seeing that on like a um, sort of like a boundary break type video where someone just took the camera and messed around. It was like, hey, there's a random dude here for no reason. <laughs> yeah, like right there on the very far right. That like spin. Apparently that's just some dude. <laughs> yeah, you can see him right there, actually. In the cutscene, what the heck? That's kind of funny. I wonder if he's like... I wonder if he's taken out during this section. It'd be kind of funny if you're still here. <laughs> this boss fight is pretty simple. It's not too difficult once you figure out what to do. You just gotta hit the planet, get some notes and fire at him. While dodging stuff. And you can use these to fire missiles at him as maybe. And Zook has different like, transformation stuff. Take a minute. There we go. On to phase three. Impossible. Impossible. <laughs> Impossible. Impossible. Just surrender, DJ Broken Record. Silence. You have barely, barely scratched the surface of my brain. I'm pretty sure I still have to do all the bosses in one go. Stooping um, to a level of idiocy. Because the Switch hey, version on, does man. not have the continue option. But apparently. It the last update did add the continue option if you're playing harder difficulties from what I know, but not in the normal difficulty. So I still have to do it in one go, but everyone else has it easier where they can continue if they die. But the downside to continuing if you die is that you're forced to only get a C rank. Which doesn't get you that many followers. Stop roll. Oh, I messed up that. Just to sleep for a little bit so that I don't lose all my health on maybe. Alright, this is easy to telegraph. A lot of difficulties you can parry these back at him. I think I managed to break out of this area one time. Oh wait. There we go, we can parry it that time. Could slightly purple. The more you know. Alright, I've ruined that. 
blast. Oh, yeah. There we go. I think I'm gonna just go ahead. <laughs> With a billion stars and a thousands upon thousands of planets. This fish shouldn't be too bad. Yeah, there we go. I got the timing then. Getting all these parries will give me a nice bonus on the score. Oh, I missed that one. There we go. There's only one way to end this. Right you are, Zook! Red light! Green light! And that's the first boss defeated. There's like six main bosses and the seventh one as well. Billions and billions and trillions. But the seventh one is technically optional. But you fight them three times. Would you like to leave a message? I think this could seem slightly graphically DSDQ? different on Switch as well. I, I think there's meant to be more of a screen here, but it's not edition. present. Uh-huh. Bump bed junction. And we're here to bring back rock. You can't be serious. You better believe it. We're not stopping till we claim our fate. And bring change to the system. Yeah, that too. Oh, police. This city has had enough of your tyrannical control. It's time we give the people what they want. Stop with the theatrix. You think you're better than me? I've said it before, and I'll say it again. The age of rock is over. That's where you're wrong. And today's win is proof that the power of rock is stronger than ever. I wonder if the guy is in this cutscene just that? chilling in the background. Huh? <laughs> piece of... Well, fine. You want to take this road? I say bring it on. We have the force to deal with the likes of you. We fight with order, and you have no place in our system. If that's what you stand for, then we want no part of your stupid regiment. It's time we fight for fairness, for the people of Vinyl City. We fight for the little guys! Zook, come here. Put your hand next to mine. Huh? Oh, okay. What are you doing? Just hold up your pinky finger. Oh, like this? No, put your hand next to mine. No, the other side. Oh, okay. A bit more to the right. No, my right. But I was moving to your right. <laughs> no, you just... Ah, never mind, move left. Like this? More. Left, 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 left. Yahoo! For the little guys. Let's see how I did. It was a pretty smooth attempt. It took me four minutes. A little bit of damage. That should be pretty good. Yeah. S tier. Awesome. This screen's also different. Um, it's fairly different on the other versions. The fans at the bottom are coloured. Um, Made in Zuka running on the screen. Most of it's similar, but there's still differences here and there. Mars attack. One with the universe. In the base track. I'll try to unlock the other versions. Last night. A sabotage at Cloud Planetarium has resulted in an unexpected change of leadership. 
The authorities have identified the group behind the interference as Bung Bet Junction, an indie rock duo. The band was led by a guitarist <laughs> who goes by the name of Mayday, followed by her drumming accomplice, Zook. Sources say they hijacked DJ Subatomic Supernova's concert close to midnight, which subsequently led to NSR's first district loss in years. However, Tatiana reassures everyone that the launch of the new NSR satellite, supervised by DJ Subatomic Supernova, went smoothly despite the takeover. The loss of the Karstek district is but a minor setback to NSR. Our launch was deemed a success. The NSR satellite is set to reach its course in orbit soon, which will mark... <laughs> Great. You owe me a TV, mate. Those NSR buffoons! We managed to defeat an artist of theirs, but somehow, they still win! Did you have to punch the TV, though? We ain't got money to spend on another one. Listen to me, Zook. Our revolution is set on a long and difficult path, so sacrifices <laughs> must be made for the greater good. No TV is going to... Oh, hey, I got a text message. <sighs> Zook! Zook! I think we just got our first fan! Say what now? His name is Clip, and he has a lot of nice things to say about us. Listen to this. <clears throat> your exceptional skills at playing your instruments while simultaneously entertaining the crowd is absolutely astounding! Why are you making that accent? <laughs> he says he wants to arrange a meeting tonight. Isn't that exciting, Zook? Our first fan meetup! Yeah, that's nice. But right now, we need to figure out our next plan of action. Like how to defeat NSR. He says he knows how to defeat NSR. Oh, he did? Zook, this guy is our biggest fan ATM. I propose we see what he has to say. We have nothing to lose, right? Well, um, yeah, sure. Why not? Awesome! Let me just reply. And send me So... How did he get your number? I don't know. <laughs> Awkwardness. <laughs> okay, Cliff says to find him at Festival Plaza. Alright, let's go see what this guy is about. I think if I remember correctly, I finished my first recording after this little bit. Just around about, yeah, it's 45 minutes in. That's pretty much where I stopped recording the first time. Let me plonk that. These two on. These actually change the music in this area. Uh, the more. Well, not. Yeah, I think the broken helmet adds that little tick kind of to the music. If I take that off. Oh, it's the microphone. Adds the little. I'm not sure what the broken helmet adds, but some of these add little. Uh, additions to the music, which is kind of cool. There's also an arcade, which I don't know if you can unlock anything from playing it, but it's it's an okay game. It is what it is. It's got like, Beat Wolf or something like that. I don't know. I've barely touched it. Into the wilderness of Final City. So we pretty much can use those collectible thingies to power stuff up and you get fans from doing so. And then you use fans to get upgrades. Oh, you? Your usual to go? Yes, and more sugar for me. No sugar for mine, please. Yeah. Uh, since anything matters. A hefty one right there, actually. <laughs> That's a pretty good one. I can now power this up. And that gets me quite a decent few men of fans. Hey, you rock stars! I saw the audition. You put out some great vibes. Can't believe you got disqualified. Neither can I. We obviously rocked it. Come, sit down for a drink or two. My treat. Thanks for the offer, but we've got some place to go. Another time then, rock stars. 
No, oh. oh, it's a little. <laughs> the jumping is a little fiddly about the double jump. I miss it. <laughs> Put it to. Oh, Christ. <laughs> Just gain velocity out of nowhere again. I can get through here, but there's like not much I can do at the moment. Oh, there's, a, there's a hidden one. There we go. Oh god. The camera <laughs> the camera is not enjoying me right now. <laughs> so yeah, this is pretty much telling you you can use the mini quasars to power stuff up. And you gain fans from doing so. Which is always very handy. Just to just to have. Oh, there's some over there. And thankfully in the version that I'm playing, these basically respawn, so I can just get as many as I'd like. <laughs> and you definitely get plenty. There's no shortage. Um, I don't think I can get up there just yet. Unless... Oh, oh, just... I didn't do anything there, I just, I just jumped and there was like a major burst of speed. Shoot damage level 1, that's kinda helpful. It's better than the base... Uh, ...thing. Uh, I can't get that yet. That's uh, level two. Feel that. I need to upgrade and get that first. And there's a little one. I can grab this. That's a health, which is pretty nice. Uh, and there's some stuff around here that I can not do that from. Just over this way. Eh, I'll deal with the stuff later. <laughs> Greetings, Mayday and Zook. You're indeed. I didn't per se. What the heck? I did have a few problems you. like that You're when I was recording. Well, just for some right. reason, Hello. the cutscene dialogue would just skip the points. <laughs> a real pleasure. So I'm Pleasure's just gonna let it run itself. I'm a huge <laughs> fan of Bunk Bed Junction, or you can say I'm your biggest number one fan. Just Cliff looks to like Tommy know. from Rugrats. DJ was beyond cool. <laughs> that Jay Tom. Not Tommy, um... NSR's wake up not Tommy, call is, is it? Long overdue. I forgot the character's name there. Right? <laughs> I, I, I knew we weren't the only ones who thought <sighs> this way. Definitely not. In fact, there is much I'd like to offer in support of your efforts. I can't believe I forgot the name of the freaking Rugrats. <laughs> Speaking of which, didn't you pick up something after defeating DJ Subatomic Supernova? You mean this? Yes, yes! The Platinum Disc! Every NSR artist has one. Having it in possession means you are the new charter for this district, and you have complete Chucky, control that's, that's over it. Chucky, that's think. Not Tommy. Uh, go ahead. Place he the looks like Chucky <laughs> from the Rugrats. Oh, so, hello, Jeff. How are you doing? Oh, so you're fine. <laughs> Let's go play that tune. Nice. If I want to, I can go down. Whoa. Never mind. <laughs> Stuff. Congratulations. You now own this district. I was going to do the audio. It's a little. Now all you have to the do audio sounds is like it's the other behind me. What the heck? Other concerts? 
Is there like an audio source where the cutscene takes place and they've moved away from it? Power to control them as well. You want a free vinyl That's CD weird. from NSR, right? Of course. How am I doing? I'm doing. I'm doing then pretty well, right? Beat the remaining I figured. I mentioned you probably were there to hear it, but I figured I'd just do play through this game again rather than doing the the, the post commentary Remember, series. I thought it would just be fun to play it again and be like, hey, check this out. <laughs> That's all I have for now. I found the mysterious chilling dude in DJ Super Tex even over the boss fight. <laughs> Here? You've done so much for us, Cliff. Come to our secret underground path. Yeah, you're always welcome to hang out with us there. This normally yeah. doesn't happen though with the audio. Mind if I do? It's over at the Don't worry. I know where it is. I'll see you there. I reckon maybe just the audio uh, is like Okay in a specific a spot start, where the cutscene takes place, but because I moved away from him briefly, which you're not really supposed to be able to do, it's like, hey, the audio is playing over here, but you're over here. <laughs> I think I mentioned that past stream or in a Discord. I think I might have mentioned it at some point, but... Can I get upgrade yet? No, I can't. Uh, let's just... Before you go, it would be an honor for me to brief you on your next fight. May I? I'd love to hear your intel, Cliff. What do you have for us? Right. Akusaka will be your next stop. I hope you're up to date with the digital space, because Sayu has been making waves there as an idol. Yeah, this is this is. Mm. And I, I, that is another thing. Like cutscenes automatically play. I have not been pressing A, but suddenly now it makes me want to press A. <laughs> okay. Wait, that photo. <laughs> I've seen her on the billboards with her squeaky voice and music. Ah, the digital idol. She's now it's really playing automatically. <laughs> Did you say digital? So, she's not even real? And she's topping charts? NSR signs on anyone who has the fame to benefit them. But you two can make a difference. Just to be clear, we're fighting a fictional character, right? Yes. Sayu will be tricky to get close to, considering her form. But behind every creation is a creator. And this applies to Sayu too. And that's how we'll beat her. So, so we not much mentioned was like the martial arts when you're ready. Again. They'll get and you to wear a suit. Word that I probably Remember, can't pronounce right. Some some real world logic. Moon so be prepared for anything. Martial art called Alrighty. Lima Lama, <laughs> which is a name that Good makes one. me think more of a South American. They finally developed a name for a character member from a while ago from around last Halloween. Nice! What would be the name if we want to share? Uh, by the way, can't help but notice that Pope. Yes! I did not press it. Cool the, <laughs> the legend. The one and only. Oh, Cliff, you just opened a can of worms. The band she started, the Ghoulings, was way ahead of its time. Nobody took rock seriously until they came along. Let me see if this plays that fine. When I, when I recorded this, this bit of dialogue just randomly stopped playing. Oh, man. <laughs> Sometimes I wish I was born earlier. Oh, 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 hang on. You would have been old enough to see them during their prime. Were you in Vinyl City back then? Yep. Please <laughs> tell me you went to their gigs. I did. <gasps> <Whoa>! <laughs> You got to see the ghoulings live! I'm so jelly. So jelly! Tell me, what was Cool Fire like? What was she like? Character question is up on <laughs> which god then looking character with the. She's got the sunglasses. Mainly black she's and got orange color. Yeah, I think hair. I remember. She's got the looks, the spunk. Eh, she had them all. That girl was rocking it, I tell you. Shook the stage like she absolutely owned it. She didn't need to change. She was flawless. Oh, Cliff, you're my new favorite guy. Such a shame that the Ghoulings got disbanded and Cool Fire faded into obscurity shortly after. 
She deserves better. She does deserve better. And you know what, Cliff? That's where you come in. You supported the Ghoulings back then. Now we need you to bring that same energy to our fight. Oh, that's the plan, young lady. We're gonna smack Tatiana to the side and reignite Cool Fire's legacy once and for all. Yes! So I recently made a name by slapping the first three letters. First three and two letters of the big description together. Her name was Bonwi. Bonwi. Bonwi Golofi? Bon Bon Bonwi Golofi. Is that how you put an oh, old dropping frames? <laughs> Not good. And I'll just let I'll sit here for a sec to see if I'll kick back. There we go, that's alright. Let's give myself some upgrades. Uh this screen is actually different um on this version compared to the other versions. Um I actually like this one more. You have a bar at the top which fills up to let you know how much fan power you've used. But that isn't there on the PS4 PC version, it's more just a number. Um, alright, so I'm gonna get... shoot. Um, I mean, I have plenty, I could get pretty much everything at the moment. Yeah, I, can, I, have, I have plenty. Uh, for, yeah, double jump, please. <laughs> I want that double jump back. <laughs> Um, music plays idly after... Oh, I need to activate your boss fights or revive... Receive half of you take pain damage. I'll take that one for now. The other one is handy, but... The value is helpful to start out with. They mention that the mods and stickers disappear, but they don't. Yeah, stickers are limited time buffs. Most stickers last around one hijack encounter, but they don't. They stay, I've noticed. <laughs> Let's get that. Soup, you can have shoot for now. We'll have more later. Mods. We only have the two for now. Mars attack, yeah, how much? One with the universe, which is alright. And in Ultimate Duet, we don't have one yet, don't we? Nah, we don't have one yet. Could you get that from a certain somebody? Nice. Alright, let's go. Oh boy, I'm <laughs> That's fine, I can find my charger somewhere. Don't know where I put it. Uh oh. <laughs> it should be. Actually, let me let me check. Wait, no, that's the wrong thing. Yeah, that one is low. Uh, bear with me one second while I try and find my charger. I'll just do this. Boop.
All right, crisis averted. I have found my charger. <laughs> well, well, technically charges. Cause it's like a USB that then splits into two, because it's a double Joy-Con. <laughs> Let me just plug that in. I ain't using my 8-bit though. Boop. There we go. Would it be better if I just put it in my PC? Probably. Yeah. That's a lot better. Sorry for the flood, Mr. Bit. Nah, it's fine. Flood all the way. <laughs> it, 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 it helps me be talkative on stream. Because I'm, I'm not the best when it comes to streaming when there's nobody talking, but you know, that happens. Okay, they are charging. Cool. So, it should be. Oh. Okay, <laughs> there was one behind there, and it's not there anymore. Maybe certain areas do and don't respawn the causes. Or maybe they update it. I don't remember. We'll see. <laughs> Like, actually, we need a little, we'll find out. Um, I don't think you're the only one who doesn't speak most when nobody's watching or talking to but I can dig away. So, well, I haven't gotten to the point where we have to tackle him yet, but I will be. <laughs> I will definitely do. DK West 2 and 3 because I did it I did it during the recording and it only took me like two attempts for round two or well, round three mind you not is the other way around. So if I pick up all this pretty sure I can uh There's some stuff here that I can actually use mini coils on, I think. There's some here. I actually did not know this was here for a bit. Like, I recently found this place, so I was like, ah, oh, neat. <laughs> let's go talk to Joey. Oh, wait, let's get that. Let's talk to Joey so I can get the difficulty. The latest hit, more like a back musician. Huh? Why don't you try this? Hard mode. Okay, cool. I don't think I really plan to replay bosses, but I, th there will be some cases where I will uh, specifically say you. I will replay when I get the rock variant because there's something I want to show off on stream. Because I'm fo I'm trying to play through the game, but also showcase differences. As many as I can, at least, that I remember. Um, if I go back down, hopefully all the quasas should be back. Apologies for being if you did, but the pronunciation of Bon Regal is a threatening voice for in. Yeah, okay, yeah, I'm right, it's back, they're all back. So I can, if I wanted to, just grind here mini causes because you get like quite a lot in this one area anyway obviously I won't grind on stream <laughs> I'll probably do so off off stream but that's just showing that you can do that at least on this version because I don't know about other versions but yeah okay let's go I've been looking all around for a British name I found interesting, but didn't really find any. I'm very satisfied with this one. That's good. Good. Very good. Alright. 
Let us make our way through the first place. And light up stuff as we go. Because I should have enough for most of it already. And getting more fans is always nice. Uh, that needs a level 2, which we don't have yet. Which we can get soon. There's a level 1. Carry radius. That's pretty nice. That takes a fair amount, but that's fine. Movement speed one. It's kind of handy to have. Got anything else over here? It's definitely not everything. Otherwise, I would have gotten. Uh, I for sure would have got some music from that. Hang on, let's go back a sec. Nope, there's nothing there. Maybe I missed something down here. Oh, camera. <laughs> I couldn't have, because I would have... I would have unlocked the music. I don't know if I've mentioned it specifically this quite a past, but a picture bomb would have an interest in stop motion animation would be pretty good at making pizza. Not the first thing most will think about of a witch, but it's stuff that I think helps build personality. Yeah! It is pretty good just to think about random things. I swear I've missed something that I can power up. <laughs> You'd think I'd know after playing this game for like twice. Not this, because I can't do anything with that. And I've been all around it. How am I, how am I like, mistracking in the smallest possible area? Is it, is it the statue? No, it's not, but I can climb on it. That's something that I know I can do. <laughs> I haven't done it before. That's fine. I'll come back to it later. Come on, I wanna get I wanna get on the statue. <laughs> I've done it once before, I got to the very top. The tippy top. There we go. Now I'm the DJ subatomic supernova. <laughs> Yes. Take a screenshot. <laughs> Which one of the districts is your favourite? Uh, good question. I'm unsure. I am not quite sure, if I'm honest. I'll just do one more sweep. Hello, robot. Uh, yeah, there's nothing in here. Was I just dumb? Did I actually get everything already? Or was I blind? Oh, I don't know, but... Oh, whatever. Let's, let's just... Let's just go. <laughs> I'll probably, like, end up getting it. <laughs> Next time around. May as well, may as well just pick up all... You know, actually, do I, do I, yeah. 
I may as well do like a round of getting all these and then maybe off camera in between streams I'll just have a seizure from the camera. <laughs> Or well, maybe it's stuff that's down here. I swear you could actually power up something. Like in these areas still. I mean, it's like, I feel like you could. DJ sub 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 pretty chill, but as you can hear, is way too busy for me. No, I can barely even remember ten tens. Yeah, ten tens was somewhat basic in a way. Such a really nice playing so but and then a short district maybe yeah. one of my favourites. He's very interesting, but I have felt about actually being there for extended period of time. That one's very basic too. It's like, well, it's artistic, but there's not a whole lot going for it. This is kind of, this is kind of why I would like them to make a sequel to this game, or maybe make a game that's set in the same universe and maybe expand upon the city, make an actual city. Because I could, I could kind of picture how they could expand the design of Vinyl City, like, make it not straight, like, I could imagine a big, like, free removal city, maybe have, like, suburbs in between districts, uh, like, city streets and all that, then you have your districts in places, but not just, like, a straight line, because Vinyl City in this game doesn't necessarily feel like a city to me. It feels like I'm in a shopping mall, <laughs> which ain't a bad thing, but, you know, I don't really get a city out of it. I mean, yeah, it's still their first game, so... They might do something, I don't know. Then the same might be awesome. I think you mentioned the past problems. Yeah, I feel like DK West could be like a third character or something like that. I feel like expand on that. Um, I, I remember watching trailers of this game, and I kind of got the impression like there'd be more like beat 'em up aspects and like areas in the city that you'd like traverse through like to get to these places and like beat up enemies and stuff along the way which I feel like that could have been an idea <laughs> music's a bit loud compared to my voice you think? that's like I'll turn it down turn it a little bit I know that this game's audio sync isn't the greatest at times And this is also one of my favourite approach themes. Approaching Sayo definitely fits for like a. Because I was working on that little. little city map in RPG Maker with that little. like synthwave aesthetic, and this theme really fit for it, which I really hope I can maybe fix it up and. Oh, nope. <laughs> no, please, I don't want to make the same mistake I did last time I was doing this. No, come on. <laughs> also, I completely forgot you could do that. Huh. I, yeah, I actually completely forgot you could do that. 
that's not a move that I typically end up using all that much. <laughs> Had to go for being nearly at the last crash, I didn't hear what you said, my apologies. That's fine. Um, what was I saying? Oh, I was pretty much saying, like, how I really like this theme. Um, fucked off when you said that you thought there'd be more than him part of it. Yeah, when I was watching the trailer originally, like, I don't know if it's, like, a bit of a Mandela effect, but I definitely remember seeing like a section of Mayday and Zoop running up like this big ramp with like the city in the background like maybe like running up the NSR tower or something like that and like I kind of got the vibe of maybe there'd be a bunch of levels in the city as you traverse to each district and every year you beat people and enemies and yada yada. That's sort of the angle that I kind of got and I feel like that's something that I could probably do in a future game. Hello, Tom from Mad Morpheus Game. <laughs> like, as much as I. Oh, no! Nope. <laughs> as much as I do love this game, um. Don't remember what's after what's yet. I probably might have not seen that. It might have been something I imagined. But I vaguely remember something like that. Um. But it's definitely something that I feel like they could expand upon. Hello, Joby. How are you? <laughs> I'm tempted to beat Sayu, try and get the rock theme, and then hop into the fight again. Because there's something I want to showcase in terms of that. What kind of role do you think DK West could fulfill? Perhaps a damage bond or healing capacities? What have been on here, but you're truly showing some Tekken skills with a gamer is. <laughs> I, I wish we could play Tekken. Like, I, I wish the PS4 version was cross-play with the PC. Because I have it on PC, but I can't... I can't play it with PC people. And frankly, I suck at it. <laughs> Uh, DK West. I definitely feel like he'd be a, more of a tank kind of character. Because he's bigger, you know, I imagine he might be a little slower. But in terms of music... Uh... Yeah, I, I reckon he could be a vocalist, kind of. Attacker, because they don't really have that. You have your guitarist and your drummer. Uh, DK West is all about, you know, the rap battles. Um, they don't have that in the duo. Uh, so that's something that could be neat. Also, this here, this mystical portal isn't here in uh, the PC version or all that. It's, I'm pretty sure it's a picture of Sayu here. Uh, other bosses have, like, the picture. Uh, things like Crash Team Racing's boss entrances, but this just has this ominous void portal. <laughs> Which is kind of interesting. <laughs> Alright, it's time to fight Shayu. The second boss. Dreamy place. Oh my! Welcome, friends! Are you here to receive the sweet honey bubbles of my angelic voice? What? Sweet honey bubbles? Oof. No way! We're here to bring Rock back to Vinyl City and. Wait, this is ridiculous. Mm -hmm. I can't that believe good. I'm talking <laughs> to this thing. I guess that one's really careful, I just, and the music's a bop, the and I need to put the little groovy guy going. <laughs> the R word you mean and then there's also, uh, Look at her, Silk. I don't have that She's anymore, that's right. Not real. I don't need that. I remember this, yeah, I did a stream on this ages back, but I didn't play the game, I just played the bosses, and I was like, hey, I want to actually do a proper series on it. 
If DK was to game play, but perhaps the song and vocals to freak to us, and she's... Person like who's ranked, who's black and see that coming from. Why didn't they animate the two characters in 3D? They do, uh, there's cutscenes where they are in 3D, but I think they wanted to go for like a stylistic choice. For the cutscenes. Which I actually kind of like. But there are, there are cutscenes where they are... The characters are animated. surprising that people don't find the DK West voice to be that great because I love it. <laughs> In fact, the, the DK West boss gameplay is something that they could do more of as well, I feel. I don't think I need to actually really bother dealing with these guys anyway, but I may as well. <laughs> Can I parry those music notes? They're purple. I don't actually know. Oh, technically I can actually show it during this, um, but I could show it better when I actually unlock the rock tune. When I get to the point, I will explain what I'm on about. Oh, you bugger. It's not a large number of people, mind you, but I've seen a number of, number of people mentioned it's not real bad. I'm just going to look at the French. It's English, and they have a nice I got you. Also, there's a little bit of the Vaporwave version going now. I can kind of hear it. Technically, Zook does less damage, but I kind of prefer using him because you get more hits in. But he can do a lot of damage with the red stickers and stuff. <laughs> Actually, though, fun fact the music in this boss has unused lyrics. Um, there is an original version which has a lot of lyrics that aren't in the final version, and I actually really like some of the first version's lyrics. I've also just kind of realized this moment in the game where effectively fighting the VTuber meanwhile I'm a PNG tuber. <laughs> I'm already half there. <laughs> hey, 
I only recently discovered that PNG tubers are a thing, <laughs> and I've been one for ages, apparently. May should have been called Gats, so let's give the Gats tubes. <laughs> But apparently a PNG tuber is basically a streamer who has a picture of their character somewhere, which is pretty much what I do. <laughs> so like, huh. Like, it makes sense, I guess. <laughs> Although a lot of them have like this plug-in uh, thing um, where like their picture kind of like goes grey and then when they're talking properly they it, like colours up, which I don't have, which I don't exactly need. <laughs> Just in perpetual buffering, yeah? <laughs> Although I have actually kind of considered getting someone to make a model for me, for the fun of it. But I wonder what people would think if uh, I suddenly just became a VTuber. Does that mean my tube son is JFK? Yes it is. <laughs> He could prefer them using a move cam. Yeah, it's a valuable thing. I probably would convert, but I don't have the PC power for it. I have heard you need a decent rig. <laughs> Alright, let's make him move. <laughs> So I make Liam's on a PS1 model. That would actually be really cool. I was, I have actually thought about wanting to get like some low poly models of my characters. Cause I would actually really love to make like an RPG in like a low poly art style or something. Like more 3D, maybe, maybe sort of like, I imagine kind of a mix of like Persona Q maybe a little bit less chibi. <laughs> Hang up, I'll still probably show it off when I unlock the rock themes, but if you pay attention to the music when it transitions to the rock version, There's a major difference in the version I'm playing. Also, I wonder if I'll get the bug again. Okay, now the whole area is here, thankfully. <laughs> I've had a time where half of this area did not load, so I was stuck on one outside. <laughs> okay, so if I... Do what I'm supposed to do and just deal damage and all that. Go back to the zoo, because I'm kind of dying. Coming out of the slow has kind of stopped attacking as well. I think that's partly supposed to happen. Okay, look, if you listen to the music... It sounds very different to the actual one that you hear in the other versions. And because... This version of the game on Switch, again, is an older build, and they didn't replace the rock theme with the newer one that is in the other versions. 
which I didn't know for a while. It's just very interesting. And it all come, it pretty much uh, all comes down to the porting process apparently. And COVID and all that. <laughs> like I find I fi I like I find all these interesting differences. They're very interesting to find out about and look at and compare. But I understand why this version isn't updated. And it ain't their fault, really. You know, people always say, you know, if your game's not ready, you delay it. But when it's a company like the people who made this game, this is also their first game. They have a job to do. They have a game to release. They did delay it once, but I don't think they could have afforded to do it again. They had to get it out, otherwise, you know, they've got to make money somehow. And I guess there was a slight rush on the porting side, because the PS4 and PC version was done in-house, while apparently the other versions were out of house, out of their offices, and other companies helped with porting, which is a very normal practice. Um, but I guess there was a mishap with the actual versions. And yeah. The Switch version and the Xbox version is behind on actual updates. You yeah. guys are quite a talented bunch, but there are bigger things at play here, and you kids shouldn't get involved. Stay in school, do your homework, most importantly, don't ever turn Sayu into that thing again. Come on, mate. Like this cutscene, actually, All this right. cutscene here, the lights are on in the other versions, but I like this one better. I like that the lights are off. <laughs> when she unplugs the plug, the lights turn on in the other versions. It's like, huh, did not notice that. How did I do? I didn't do too well that time around, but I'll still take that, eh? <laughs> Gives us a fair amount of fans. Which is actually kind of interesting. The Switch version still hasn't received the update for the Christmas DLC, and there hasn't been much news on when that's being released. Once again, the group known as Bang Bat Junction has hijacked yet another concert. Even the cute and bubbly Sayu was not spared from their plan for total dominance. We managed to get hold of these two elusive rockers while they were cowardly fleeing from the scene at Akusuka last night. Mayday, Zook, why are you hijacking NSR's concerts? Huh? Wait, are you guys from the news? Am I on TV right now? <laughs> yes, a lot of people are distressed by your reckless behaviors. Do you have any remorse for your actions? Wow, I am on TV! Hi, hi, hi! Great, you owe me a TV, Tatiana. I don't even know why you put your TV in my <laughs> office in the first place. Anyway, we need to fix this right now. Bring me the Horn of Mending. The Horn of Mending? Please do not tell me you are thinking of asking for that guy's assistance. Desperate times calls for desperate measures. We'll lose more than just a district if we don't act immediately. Now bring it. Here comes the lad. The big Chad. <laughs> There's our lad, Dickie West. <laughs> Hello, Queen Bob. How are you? Well, well, well. I can hear a costume to go hard, too. Nice to see you, too, Dickie West. 
the lad, the big chan, basically. <laughs> Mainly extrovert Shrek. <laughs> I am going to check if the editors downstairs need my input. Jubalagi to edit. Gross. All right. Aku sini. Kau boleh mula bila bila masa. I take it you're unaware of the events that have transpired within Vinyl City in the past few days? <laughs> I thought so. A band called Bunk Bed Junction has been slowly claiming our districts. They're now moving up to. Tatiana, si manis. This looks so much like so much. Yeah, I can see the, city, okay? the art style influence. Come on, I don't have all day in it. For five other classes mm -hmm. attaching, I they initially won't Did I mention that one of the members of this band is a drummer named... That's pretty nice. Thought that might be of interest to you. The glasses do fit. <laughs> Whoa. Go get the... Zook. Oh, ho, oh, oh, ho, oh, oh, ho, oh. ho, ho. We're climbing the charts. <laughs> Alright. Let's see. Let's see what upgrades I can get. Oh, I can't yet. Wow, I was only 50 fans off from unlocking the next level. Okay. That's great to know. <laughs> nice. I mean, I could get some fans from like the outside easily, but damn. <laughs> uh, I think I'll put shoot damage two on Zook as well as health on you two. I've got health as well. Yeah, that'll be decent. Decent to start with. Mods. Purifying water. I'll have that for now. Oh, I can put both on actually now. Um, yeah, I can just put both. I don't really use these mods all that much, thinking about it. I can't beat you yet. What's up, Lid? Spectacular performance at Akusuka, you two. Simply impressive. Thanks. Your gadgets and hints were helpful. Yeah. What have you got for us next? I'm still in the midst of preparing, but there's been quite a commotion in the alley nearby. Perhaps you could go see what the fuss is about while I finalize these. I'll be done soon. No rush, Cliff. Yeah. Take your time. We'll go see what the hoo-ha is about. Okay, that 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 automatically cut itself off, and now I can feed. Yeah. All right. I think if I feed you like four times, you know, the helipad. Like or the the alligator pad thing. <laughs> All right. It's time to face against Mr. West for the first time. The first time is mandatory, uh, then round two and three you can not do if you don't want to, it's optional, but I think I will most likely try them anyway. Mayday and Zook, I've been waiting! Woo, for what? Oh, where are my manners? I'm Zam. I heard about your gig with the DJ and saw what you did at Akusuka. I gotta say, I'm thrilled to see your efforts to make a change. Simply inspirational. Thanks, Sam. Why don't you join us in Stand Against NSR? Interesting that you should say so. I'm currently starting my brand new radio channel for the occasion. Oh, that's cool. Our preparation's going. 
It was going fine until the place was reclaimed just the other day. It'll take some time for me to recover my equipment and set up a new broadcasting booth. You need a place? Why don't you come over to our pad? We happen to have some extra space. Can I? Really? What do you say, Zook? <laughs> the NT sure of thing. the more the merrier. <laughs> awesome! I'll get Sam and Fam up in a jiffy and have you guys on it soon! Nice. I think I could actually... Did I already get everything in this area that I can already mostly use the quarters on? I think I did. So we're good to progress. There's the lad. Let's go. <laughs> Bro. Oh, brother. Eh, eh. That the away baru, bro. So fast. Rubber around my four by copy guys, Carl. Huh? <laughs> Missy. Namaku DK West. Eh, wah. Oh, I'm sneezing. Eh, wah. Dulu dan kini hebat selamanya. Eh, wah. Dan satu lagi. Aku pun sebenarnya Zook punya. Oh, brother. Exactly. <laughs> Zook's big brother. Salam perkenalan. I actually think one of these cutscenes have different camera angles oh. in this version too. So this is your brother? How come you don't share his accent? Well, I don't know. How come your hair is yellow? <laughs> What's that got to do with West? What are you doing here? Oh, tak ada apa. Cuma kongsi aja dengan orang kat sini apa erti music sebenar. <laughs> Real music. Got some stuff at this point now. <laughs> Kau betul nak buat hal kat sini. Sekarang. Ooh, ee. Kau selalu macam tu. Angry only. Aku lupa birthday kau. You angry. Tak jawab message kau. You angry. Aku jual drum set I think kau. this bit. You angry. Yeah, this bit here the camera is different. Kan macam tu lah. Stop it West. You're disrupting our music revolution, man. We've got tons of things to do, and I don't have time to play around with you. You understand? Hey, relax, bro. Relax. Kalau kau nak fans kau balik, senang je. Tunjuk kat mereka siapa lebih hebat. Hadap aku di... Ewa! Rap battle! I said I don't have time to play. Okay lah, aku pergi curi lagi fans kau. Ah, fine then. Let's get this over with. I remember the first time I played this, I thought you had to hit the little red things and not avoid them. <laughs> when you see Zook in school, he was constantly out of fuel. All he does is follow me. Like a stinking fly, he can't help it, cuz. I'm the trailblazing guy. Zook knows nothing like a baby. Everywhere he looks, he thinks maybe. I have to show him the ropes, but all he does is move. In school, he ain't nothing but a ridicule. He thinks he's yeah, but like student, this first one. But when in truth, he's nothing but imprudent. Feels like some shit like him doing no damage from him. <laughs> I mean, this one's pretty easy. Is he a stat user? Yes. <laughs> Maybe the trailer is in this one, I'm looking at the same sort of thing. I'm looking at the same sort And it's tended to be rushed for an accident. He's such a rookie. He got a Mexican fight off him. Don't see it myself. Yeah, I don't receive it either. Because you're my brother. If not, seven be bothered. And because I'm the world's greatest, you can pause. Go all in my shadows. Bats in the awesomeness. The magnificence. The one and only. DK West. Don't 
doing a thing? You think you're the center of everything, but this greatness that you speak simply hides the fact that you're me. It's kind of catchy, and yeah. It's really good music. <laughs> and your rhymes are just behind the times. You think that you are a king, but if I said that, I'd be lying. The world doesn't revolve around you. Even in the multiverse, you're not worth a verse. Oh, rest, 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 rest in peace. Oh, he's a dust. <laughs> In college, he still thirsts for my knowledge. Only knows how to trim me by, or else I do high. He does nothing but cry. He thinks he's a real ace when he's a real bad case. All he does is copy my moves and make the scratch tempos that don't go. I think you can pretty much tell when you're close to finishing the rap battles when you're getting closer, the more you get pushed back each time. I think. Is such a shame. The top spot is no longer his. Never mind, that was actually pretty far back. Has not been dropped, dropped, dropped in half. He hates seeing me succeed so well. He turns into a child and beats college. Bye bye. The once great West, with all his charming ability, has now learned a hard lesson in humility. A real baddie robber, not even a showstopper. He stole all my friends and none, none, none of his own. And Nadia, man, you remember that girl? You only added her because I was in the sheet. You couldn't stop at stealing friends. You stole a girl that made me put it free. Damn, look at that. You ain't nothing without West. You ain't nothing without West. You ain't nothing without West. <laughs> Deeper songs are pretty interesting and based on the deeper shots of the name. Cultural limits such as weighing the tree, the kind of music. That's squishing, pushing, pushing. Ewa, Conan Hero, actually see Desperado. From a scale of 1 to 10, you are below the bottom of the lame, lame end. You are never as good as you thought, all your imagination never had a drought. You think you're a marathon runner. You never even ran, ran a pilot, you were cancelled, the end. As you left college with the most shame to hide, left the loser, snooze up my brother. Oh, mic drop, reality oh, check, please. Damn. Cash, <laughs> that adulting life, you DK hack. I think that's the last one. Yeah. That's round one, damn. <laughs> no, you didn't. Macam ni lah. Kau pergi rehat dulu. Aku datang balik bila kau boleh rap macam pro. Okay, bro. West out. Hey, where are you going? I want this battle fair and square. You hear me? Hey! Hey! Right. Okay, leave. Just leave. Go. Yeah, okay. There's a, there's plenty of time where I can look at chat in between what happened the to bits. Zook, the chillest music man in Vinyl City. <sighs> yeah, I know, I know. Just that the sky is so so. Ewa, Ewa. There's actually a funny thing that I have noticed a very few people do with this game. Um, the kind of YouTubers who, who make... Oh, we got an extra ring. Nice. Um... I was going to say the top, actually. Ah. Yeah, I might. <laughs> but I guess it'll always. Um... The kind of YouTubers who make those, like... Such and such game, all bosses, that kind of thing. I've noticed a lot of people make videos like that on this game. But they only ever include DK West round one, and they don't include two and three. It's like, hey, you didn't do all the bosses. <laughs> he still counts. It still counts as two more bosses. <laughs> all right. Uh, let me see over here. Let 
desperate in the air. Can I get transform? Yeah, transform stay out longer. Um, level two and three transformations are. I forget where we are. I think they're down here. If I remember correctly. This is pretty interesting. Every ammo. All right, let's get a Zuki boy some stuff. That made a increase ammo and all right, that'd be good. Then over here. I want to dash. Dash is always nice. And then I can get successful parry for free ammo, which is always nice to have. I can get that too. Okay, nice. Fair amount of stuff. I need to get to 15,000 fans for level 3, which should not be a problem. Should not be a problem for me. To Zamp FM. Good afternoon, folks of Vinyl City. You're now tuned into a very special segment here on Zamp FM. I have some rare guests with me today. Let's have them introduce themselves. Hello, peeps. I'm Bumpet Junction's meaty. And this is the other half of Bumpet Junction, uh, Zook. Welcome, Mayday and Zook. Thanks for having us. The pleasure's mine, Zook. Now, a lot of our listeners know of Bunk Bed Junction, but they want to know more. I hope that through these sessions, you guys can tell us more about yourselves, your band, and everything else in between. So, without further ado, I'll go ahead with my first question. How did the band's name come about? First of all, it's because Bunk Bed Rock. We have one, with me taking the top bunk, of course. Okay, but what about the junction bit? Didn't you say on TV that you wanted to build a junction into NSR's highway so that more people can join the party? Doesn't that contradict the whole part about you fighting NSR? Glad you asked. Today we are unveiling Bunk Bit Junction's new meaning. We want to build a junction that goes away from NSR's highway because they don't deserve any fans. They blow. Oh, does this tie into what you want to do with your music in Vinyl City? We believe that music belongs to everyone, and not just NSR. We're going to fight for the people, for music, for artists like us. An ambition that is highly looked upon by many, Mady and Zook. Do you feel pressured with a sudden wave of attention? Your fan base has been growing rapidly as of late. I'm not sure if, depending on what you pick, depends on how many fans you get afterwards. Is there a difference between what you pick? Does it actually matter? Because I actually don't know. Well, just... a little, but it's the good kind of pressure. One that will May's voice might be a bit inconsistent, but I'm like, yeah, that's because of it. Someone yeah. has to stand up for musical freedom here in Final City. Couldn't have said it better myself. Time's almost up. Don't want to be chipping more of your busy schedule. Thank you for being here today, but you're welcome. But you pretty much get a bunch of fans from this from doing this. There's a few times you can do this thing for the game and you get a sticker. Nice. That'll be actually pretty handy. I'll slap that on to Zook. Get it Wait. What? Where is it? You get we did just see that. I did just get a level 2 sticker. What did I end uh, Maybe it'll show up if I like end up with anything and coming back. Weird. <laughs> so, did you guys manage to deal with the alley problem? Yep. Turns out it was Zook's big brother this whole time. <laughs> well, that does. Oh, it's bad, alright. Mm, excuse me? Nothing. <laughs> um, let's just get on with the next mission, shall we? Right. To business. Today we'll be dealing with something quite unique. Are you guys ready for the classics? Will my master's degree be helpful for this? <laughs> you bet. Head towards the nature of district. I've prepared some tickets for you. Tickets? What are we watching? The question is, 
Who, a performance by Vinyl City's greatest pianist, Yinu. Truly a child prodigy. Child? We'll be going against a kid? Um, that sounds... Don't underestimate her just because of her age. I would advise you to approach Yinu with extra caution. Despite NSR's bias, it's no simple feat to be where she is at her age. Got it. Well, I'm not one to refuse a gig invitation. Let's go, Zook. And thanks for the tickets, Cliff. My pleasure. I, I, I always enjoy the Yinu boss fight. I mean, I enjoy most of the boss fights in this game. <laughs> They're all pretty good. Uh, this one in particular, I, I enjoy the music a lot. And it's great. Child prodigy. <laughs> Yo, if it is Hey there! What's up? That gig at Akasuka? We showed them. Yeah. You have my support. Definitely. I got drinks to see you too. Sure. Catch you later. Pointless darling. <laughs> that scene is I honestly find pretty filler. Actually, I wonder if I can find where is where's the guy? Where's the dude? Where is he? Oh actually. I got here. There's a thing. Here. Oh, yeah, I know where the guy I'm thinking of is. He's in um, one of the funnier districts. Funny district, but further districts. <laughs> There's actually something that I want to point out. Throughout the game, as you go through there, it shows these little things of who you're fighting next. But they don't play the audio again afterwards. But they're supposed to. Um, like it's showing this GG subatomic one here, which you don't even see. There's supposed to be audio for it, which doesn't play at least on this version. And there's also supposed to be different versions of the city theme. Um, but they don't play here either. Whenever there's a program on TV about child produce makes you want to jump off a building. <laughs> I mean, but yeah, yeah, it's probably it's probably a difference in the versions because again, this has a lot of differences. Around here. There's a very few stuff that I can do. Oh no, these do. Oh, I remember. I am an idiot. This did count towards like the turning on stuff. So the one back in DJ <laughs> Subtub <laughs> place does count. Um, but I can't get it yet because of uh, the fact I don't have the level two upgrade yet. That is actually my bad, I forgot about that entirely. <laughs> you know, I'd actually kind of like to try and make my own, uh, like, NSR OC kind of art style. I kind of want to try doing that. Because it has been kind of... There we go, Rock Truck unlocked. Um, because it, it, it has been kind of fun trying to draw in different art styles lately. Like I've done with uh, drawing in um, my Etch's art style when I drew a couple of their characters. As well as Susie in the style she did for the one commission. That was, that was fun doing. It didn't take long to draw as well, which is kind of nice. It was quite refreshing.
But, all right, I think... I think I'll do... I'll tackle Yinu now, and then... I'd say that would be a good place to end up wrapping the stream up. Because that's practically halfway through the game. <laughs> and it's also like half ten. Ugh. It'd be getting late. <laughs> I think you'd be able to do so Tim Burton like style. Which you could look at further than that. Yeah. I'm unsure what I'd make yet. I kinda wanna make a male character, because I neglected that, admittedly. I would like to try and draw more male characters. I, I do have a tendency of making a lot of female characters and drawing them. <laughs> Not that there's anything wrong with that, per se. <laughs> but it never hurts to branch out. I mean, it's not like I've never drawn a male character before. I've done it a couple times. I'm thinking of some design for Magnus, I haven't tried to sketch them out. That's fair. <laughs> Let's take out those guys. Thankfully, you don't need to destroy literally every single character. <laughs> well, every single character, every single little enemy on the screen. There we go, nice. Hmm. Did not mean to do that one. <laughs> I meant to do the other one. Leave this to me. Would you be alright with doing an art trade? Of course. I don't really have many art ideas I really want to do at the moment, so I probably wouldn't mind doing something like that soon. Alright. Here's what I was actually talking about. Yinu has like a big portrait thing here. Um, but Sayo didn't. At least in this version. Alright, boss fight time. I think in the demo, this area was a tiny bit different. If I remember, it might have been exactly the same. I remember something was a little different. I do know the cutscene, like, um, images were different. Mayday and Zook? I knew it! 
And you knew how to smug face in the demo. Yeah, you need to speak up. The acoustics here isn't designed for speech clarity. Talk big about music. Hmm. You guys seem to be good for That's a good question. Because you have a lot of characters no! to pick from. <laughs> I'd have to think about that. I'll show you why they call me the Golden Maestro of Vina City. So in this cutscene, uh, Yinu here, she'll pull an angry face, very, very oh, angry face, God, right about now. But in the demo, <laughs> she did a smug face instead, like. <laughs> Which I, can't, I actually can't like that bit more. <laughs> I think we just got schooled by a kid. All right, time to fight the boss that I think I fought the most because I like it a lot. So I remember saying, oh, I thought I had a glitch that the health wasn't going down in this bit, but I was just an idiot, because you're not taking damage to the main thing, you're just destroying the ropes. <laughs> The difference that I thought was in um, I'm, I'm still running. <laughs> I remember watching Miss Multiplayer this and for some reason on this bit the camera was very zoomed out and I thought that was a difference for that version specifically. It isn't. That was just a glitch. <laughs> I was like, huh, is the camera like panned out? Is it supposed to be panned out even more? No. That was just a bug on her playthrough. Oh, I've kind of got the timing off for... Okay, this, in the normal one, there is no parry here. And the frame rate's fine, but on later difficulties the game lags a bit. Which is kind of funny. <laughs> But yeah, the camera was supposed to be this distance, but for some reason it was zoomed way out. Which is kind of an interesting oddity. <laughs> Dodge rolling involved <laughs> in this fight. <laughs> there we go. Get that parry. Shoot. Now. Oh, the thing was gone. Okay. I was kind of wondering where 
the other shooty mix shoot she would have been, but it wasn't in there. Oh, they're all here, though. Such a way with words, is he? Uh, let me move? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh! Zook's audio line did not play. He's supposed to say something about having a master's degree. He didn't say it. Oh yeah, there's a difference here. There's supposed to be like a forest background. It ain't here. Also, apologies for flashing lights. <laughs> yeah, there's supposed to be like a foresty kind of background. Uh, in this area, but it's not present here. <laughs> You're inside the little zone, yep. <laughs> So this phase will be interesting because I didn't know about there's an and an, an, there's uh, there's pretty much an initial I'm losing track of my words there's an initial rock phase in the song that plays before the full rock version. Right now there's a mix between the EDM and the normal. But as I go through this bit, it'll shift to the rock version. In pretty much all the other versions of the difficulty, you can beat this part of the stage so fast that it'll skip entirely over um, the initial EDM version. So I completely forgot it existed, and I thought, hey, is this even in the game? That helps a bit. Um, but it should play some point during this fight. Because it takes a while through this phase that it has enough time to play it. <laughs> Just 
stop playing roundabout now. Let me listen. There it is. This part I barely hear because I finished this phase way too quickly. Should be the final block. There we go. And they just cut to the full rock. So that's like an interesting little factoid. There's only one way to end this. Way ahead of you, Sook. Red Green light. A little bit of a camera glitch there. <laughs> Lina, my dear, you got them. Now, live for Mama one last time. I hate you all. I hate you all. I so hate you all. Let's see if I can get Whoa, through this bit without taking damage. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> as soon as I say that, damage. <laughs> but I should definitely be careful. Because I can't swap characters here. I think this is the only time in the game where the Metis, like, has a metric explosion. <laughs> I wonder if this next cutscene will be okay audio-wise. Let's, let's find out. Whoa! Yeah, it seems okay. For some reason during uh, Miss Multi's playthrough, this cutscene just... the volume exploded. <laughs> And it's a bit of an emotional scene. <laughs> no. Oh, man. You imbeciles. Uh-oh. You imbeciles! You've ruined everything! Do you have any idea what you've done? Oh, you're still talking? Why don't you come here and say that to my face? Bring it! Bring it! I think... A lot of thumbnails and for the demo, I think they used that shot, but I think they edited the eyes a little bit, I think I remember that. I, I assume that was part of the boss fight <laughs> when I first saw that. I 
Oh, I also just noticed, but um, thank you for the follow. Um, if I pronounce the name right. If it's, if it's pronounced Gion, Gion Gray underscore me. I appreciate the follow, thank you. If I got that name right. <laughs> I don't have my alerts back yet, so I didn't actually see that pop up aside from the little thing down there at the middle. My little, little list thing. How did I do? I took 10 minutes, jeez. <laughs> I mean, just take like a decent time the first time around, okay. I'll take the B. I could do better. But I notice I typically do better on the harder difficulties, because there's... The boss fights are harder, but you have more opportunity to parry stuff. So you get more damage in, meaning you get a better score from pretty much what I've noticed. So in a way, like, I do find some bosses easier on higher difficulties. <laughs> Lame's peachy. <laughs> No, yeah, we made some pretty good progress in this one stream. Nice. Um, I don't think I really have enough to really get anything else. I can, you know, definitely get that. That's pretty help helpful. Uh, I've got everything from Mayday for now. Over here... Finish off enemies if it was a double pickleball. Slightly more of that. I think I prefer... Collecting additional ammo while having the maximum amount turns them into energy. I think I prefer getting this on double ammo and then I... Can get this as well to slightly enlarge the circle. Nice. I could probably grind fans off camera. Probably that's what I might do. But yeah, um, I'd actually say that is a good ending point because uh, we're practically we are practically halfway through the game. We there is still. If we don't count DK West 2 and 3, technically, I think I'm at the point where I can fight DK West round 2. Which I could probably do, like, at the start of next stream, maybe. Um, just trying to think if I could quit the game. <laughs> I'll probably just leave it like that, thinking about it. Put up a paywall and you'll attract just the fans, you'll attract only fans. God damn it. <laughs> Hang on. Bear with me just a second. Let's like, do this. Because yeah. I have one thing I've been looking forward to for this whole stream, actually, um, is being able to show something nifty off. And yeah, I finally have my new thanks for watching screen. If it'll want to go over, yeah, there, sh there it is. I'm really, really happy with how this turned out. I'll just plot some music again. Um, I want to give a shout out to Verliot for drawing the background, and I. Did some final touches by giving her the posters you see in the background, uh, the desktops. I made a quick desktop there to have on that monitor. And I thought it turned out really nicely. Um, the poster of Sophia in the background I actually have in my room, and the one of Susie next to it I'm actually having turned into an actual poster, which hopefully will come soon, and I'll have that up in my room. <laughs> But yeah, I'm, re I'm really happy with how this this scene turned out. I've been <laughs> really meaning to get one made to replace the other one that I had. 
Now I guess all I need to- I mean, I'm still pretty content with this scene, but I'd like something better than that. So maybe that'll be my next stream thing that I get commissioned. But yeah, this was a very good stream. Um, I think I'll try and stream maybe tomorrow if I feel like it, because I definitely want to play more No Show Roads. Um, either that or maybe Monday. Definitely in a few days' time, I'll try and stream again. And we'll just see what happens. You missed the stream? No, but you're in time to at least see the thanks for watching stream in action. <laughs> there, there's, there, there's Valia, the lovely person who made this background. Go, go and drop them a follow because they do lovely streams too. <laughs> I feel a little bit bad that you just joined as I'm wrapping up, but I have been going for almost three hours, well, two and a half hours, and it's kind of late on my end. <laughs> but but I'll, I'll definitely try and stream again in the next few days or so. <laughs> it was a fun stream. Yep, you had a good stream. I did, I had a very good time. <laughs> Just commanded Liam to give my compliment to the artist, but now I can cut out in the middle, kick Liam out of the room, compliments to you, artist person. <laughs> but, yeah. Um... I don't know, are you, are you planning to stream anytime soon, fairly? Because if you're streaming today, I, feel, I don't know if you're feeling like you're going to go back to streaming. Because remember you said you weren't feeling too well, but if you're planning to stream, then I guess I could send all these people your way. <laughs> or if anyone else is streaming, I guess. I don't know, is anyone live? I can't really check. Might give myself another week of stream, that's fair. I was honestly, I was still honestly really surprised at how quick you drew this background. Like, I was kind of expecting to wait a good few days, which would have been understandable for this kind of thing, but like, you finished it like the day of the sketch, and I was like, what the hell? <laughs> like, how? <laughs> I wish never would take care of taking leave for the night, it's almost midnight. Yeah, it's like 11pm for me. Hi, everybody. <laughs> Hello, Chris. <laughs> I feel bad that everyone's joining as I'm gonna wrap up. <laughs> but I have been going for like two and a half hours, which is kind of my extreme limit. I kind of get tired, just like Susie here, who is asleep <laughs> from streaming too much. But yeah. Everyone do go check out Voliot at least, and maybe drop a follow on her Twitch. And maybe check her strums out when she gets back to streaming, because she does the good, the good art and all that kind of stuff. Voliot is Dutch for left and in left behind and the like. There's a, there's a meaning for everything in Dutch, according to you. <laughs> Like I could probably just go and do a wibble swibble swabble, and you'll be like, "Hey, that mean that's that's Dutch for you're a you're an idiot," and I'm like, "Oh." <laughs> Wait, anyway, I'm gonna wrap the stream up here. It was a good time. I kind of have been putting off a stream. Um, last stream was like six days ago. But it, mainly the issue was just I didn't know what I want to stream and then just like, hey, no stray roads, that's a game, let's play it. <laughs> but yeah, I'll definitely try and stream again in the next few days and I'll try my best to keep a little bit more active on the streaming side of things and Try and pre-plan things that I'd like to play. I kind of want to play Rescue Shot now too, after listening to the music again. 
Uh, but yeah, um, we'll probably give myself a few days just to have a breather, um, as I like to do. Maybe try and figure out more music that I can use with this screen. Because I only have the one, and I need more chill stuff. Um, and get more music and shiz. And just, yeah, get some more stuff. <laughs> anyway, look, I knew I looked it up and made it up, so it made me laugh. I was like, I made up a way and pretend to be a real word. <laughs> But yeah, I'm gonna wrap things up now, and I'm probably gonna end up hitting the hay soon, like like Susie here, because it's late for me. But yeah, thank you everyone for watching, and also thank you to. Uh, I'm pretty sure the name is like Gion something for the follow. I appreciate that. One step closer to a hundred followers. I think it's hundred followers. Yeah, something like that. But yeah, I shall see you all next time. Boy, boy. Oh, wait. Who? Hang on. What was that? What? What? What just happened? <laughs> oh no! Wait. Literally, everyone is joining as soon as I finish. <laughs> They're like <so> salty. <laughs> what just happened? Let me. Let me. I think, thanks for the follow. <laughs> but I'm literally wrapping up the stream. <laughs> Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> and I said, I'll, try, I'll definitely try and stream again in the next few days if people want to catch me then. But yeah, anyway, I'm going to stop dawdling around and I'm going to hit the stop streaming button if, unless I end up going for another 6 million years. <laughs> I'll see you all next time. <laughs>